Congo Party is bigger than James Marabe, bigger than him, bigger than all of us. It's an institution that is timeless. It will live on. It is its own set of procedure. Clear processes. indictment of lack of leadership. And I'm going to discuss with Prime Minister James Marabe. So I want him to put the leadership on the table. And as I say from the beginning, I'm Pangu. I have seen on the paper some fellows from Pangu have decided to divorce themselves from Pangu. With due respect to them, I will respect the decision. But for me, it's not to divorce myself from Pangu, but remaining there in Pangu. Get the Pangu political wing to meet, together with the, uh, the uh, non-party members, particularly the office bearers of Pangu, to meet. Call a joint meeting past as we can. And discuss this issue and talk on the leadership. I want the international community, those people who have want to invest in this country, know that at least a senior leader, I'm not trying to be boastful, but it's a fact, as a senior consent leader has called for the Prime Minister to put the leadership on the table and allow the party to decide. And if, if the party decides that there should be a change, and I am too sure, depends on whoever. We got somebody who is confident to take the leadership. I am pretty sure and have confidence that the confidence of the investors will rise. And there is, as you know, there's always there's also so many many reasons they have raised up by the public and the police. My good friend, uh, Governor of Morobi, is a senior in uh, in uh, in the country. Uh, we invited him into uh, into uh, a Pango Party, and uh, he you know has every right, like every other member of Pango, to uh, to. Uh, advocate for something he believes in. Uh, that is within his right. Pangu Party is bigger than James Marape, bigger than him, bigger than all of us. It's an institution that is timeless. It will live on. It is its own set of procedure processes. We have a parliamentary wing. We have a non-parliamentary wing. Uh, those, those engagements are very, very much like James Marape is not in the habit of stopping leaders from speaking out. I am a Melanesian leader. I am not a leader from elsewhere. I allow my people to speak and the majority consensus will take its course.